Hello children, I hope you all are doing well. This is Shweta Bajaj, your math teacher. Here, I'm back with chapter 1, Knowing Our Numbers. But before starting, firstly, please like and subscribe my channel so that you get the video notifications on time. And while commenting, please don't forget to mention your class in section. And the PDF of the chapter, uh, chapter 1 is available in the home tutorial in the green box above the videos at jmps.org.in. Before starting, I request all of you to make the notes on these topics. If possible, please make one thick register. Do your homework and assignments regularly as it will be checked and marks are allotted for it. Now, in the previous two videos, we discussed the topics place value, face value, predecessor, successor, Indian and international system of numbers. I hope you understood and did the questions related to it given in videos part 1 and part 2. So today in part 3, we are going to take the topic comparing of numbers. The topic is comparing of numbers. So there are some rules to compare the two numbers. Firstly, now what is the first step? Firstly, we used to count the number of digits. If the number of digits is different, then the number having the larger number of digits is bigger than the other number. For example, you are having for example, if you are having two numbers with you, in one number, suppose there are nine digits and in the other number, there are seven digits, then the number having more digits will be the bigger number. That means the number having nine digits will be the bigger number. Now, second case, when the number of digits is same, then we will start by comparing the digits at the highest place value that is the digit at the left the number having a larger digit at this place is larger if they happen to be seen then compare the digits next to the leftmost digits and carry on in this way till you get the larger digit the number having the larger digit will be the larger number let us understand this with the help of some examples. Example number one. They are asking which is smaller out of these two numbers. So we will what we will do firstly. Firstly, we will count the number of digits in the first number and number of digits in the second number. On counting the number of digits, we are observing that the first number has nine digits and the second number has eight digits. Now, as you know that nine is greater than eight. So that means the number having eight digits will be the smaller number. So that means here the second number that is uh, 5 crore 66 lakhs 78,860 is smaller than 86 crore 80 lakh 57,807. Now, I hope it is clear to you. I hope it is clear to you. Right? Now, move on to our next example. In the next example, they are asking which is greater. See, two numbers are given to you. Okay, so first step, what is the first step? Firstly, we will count the number of digits. On counting the number of digits, we are observing that the first number has 9 digits and the second number also have 9, nine digits. So, since the number of digits is same in both, so in this case, what we will do? We will make a place value chart. We will make a place value chart after making a place value chart after making a place value chart we will compare each column we will compare each column on comparing the first four columns i am observing that they are having the same numbers so i i'll move on to the fifth column in fifth column that is the column of 10,000, I am having 1 and 6. 
as you know that 6 is greater than 1 therefore therefore since 6 is greater than 1 therefore uh, our second number that is 87 crore 65 lakh 68,198 is greater. Please look this carefully and I hope it is clear to you. So, let us move on to some questions based on it. See one question based on it. They are saying write the greatest and the smallest numbers in the following. Some numbers are given to you. Okay. So first of all what you will do. You will make, <coughs> you will make a place value chart. After making this place value chart. You have to write all these numbers in this place value chart. Uh, in the previous video you people learnt. How to write the numbers in a place value chart okay same way you will write all the numbers in the place value chart after writing the numbers in the place value chart count the number of digits count the number of digits in each number on counting the number of digits in the first number you got how many digits you got to know that there are seven digits same way in second number how many digits are there seven digits in third number how many digits are there six digits further in next number fourth number how many digits are there again there are six digits and in the last how many digits are there there are 1, 2, 3, 4 and 5 digits. Now compare them according to their digits. Firstly see this last number is having very less digits that is 5. So that means this will be our smallest number. Okay. Since the number of digits is less. So this will be our smallest number. Now in order to write down the greatest number I will look, look at the firstly the number of digits. Out of this these two numbers are having both each 7 7 digit right. So I will start comparing it from the left side. Left side. Now what is the first number here in the 10 lakh column 2 and what is the first number in the second uh, number that is 1. Clearly you know that this uh, 2 is greater than 1. So that means this first first number is our the largest or the greatest number. So that means 23,56,098 is our greatest number and 29,807 is our smallest number. I think uh, it's clear to you. Now let's move on to one, one more question. Next question. It says that find the sum of the smallest and the largest number. So the procedure will be same. You will make a place value chart. In the place value chart you will uh, write down the numbers. After writing down, down the numbers you will count count their digits firstly you will count their digits you will count their digits firstly right after counting the digits what you are observing you are observing that the second number and the fourth number both are having four four digit each both are having four four digit each and uh, the first number is having five digit third number is having six digit and the last number is also having six digit so the number having four four digit each out of these two numbers we can have our smallest number so on comparing clearly this three is less than five so that means our 3098 will be our smallest number and for finding out the largest number what we will see we will see the numbers having six six digit each and we will compare them starting from the left starting from the left now on comparing the lakh column 
their lakh in the lakh column both are having 3 3 each so we move on towards the 10000 column in 10000 column uh, third number is having 7 and the last number is having 6 you know that 7 is greater than 6 so this means this uh, 3 lakh 78000 32 is our largest number okay after finding out the largest and the smallest number you have to find out its sum sum means what you have to add them now uh, see how to add them after finding the smallest number and largest number their addition uh, the bigger number will be written at the top and uh, the smallest number will be written at the bottom now we will start adding from this side add this 2 to this 8 on adding 2 to 8 we will be having 10 so for from this 10 we will write 0 here and 1 will be carried now this 1 will be added to this on adding this 1 plus 3 4 4 plus 9 will gives us 13. So we will write 3 here and 1 will be carrot. And now 1 plus 0 will gives us 1 only. And 1 plus 0 will again gives us 1. Further 8 plus 3. 8 plus 3 will gives us 11. Now from 11 I will write 1 here and 1 will be carrot. Now this 1 will be added to this 7. 1 plus 7 will gives us 8. Further, uh, here 3, 3 will be as it is. Okay, so our sum will be nothing but 3,81,130. I hope it is clear to you. So, after understanding how to compare the two numbers or how to choose the greatest and the smallest numbers from the given numbers, I hope you will be able to solve these questions. These uh, are from exercise number 1A, page number 7, 8, uh, question number 4, 5 and 8 you have to do and exercise number 1C on page number 15, question number 3 you have to do. Okay and uh, I hope you like the video and if you have any doubts or query you can leave the message in comment section and for the chapter you can see the pdf at gmps.org.in thank you